Another task that Sonic Fire Pro is good at is adding music to audio-only clips, like scoring a podcast. But to do that, you have to import your audio file. Let me show you how. You go up to the File menu, go down to Import Audio File. I've created a very special VO because it illustrates a special point about Sonic Fire. We click Open, but notice it doesn't show up in the timeline. It shows up down here in the bin window. To load it to the timeline, select the clip you want to load to the timeline and click the Move It Up to the Timeline button. Now when we play this... Welcome to Digital Production Buzz. Talk radio for digital production. post product. Notice that it's only coming out the left-hand channel. That's because when I saved the clip, I saved it as a mono file. And when Sonic Fire sees a single track clip, instead of panning at center, it pans it over to the left-hand side. So if you're bringing audio in, be sure that it is output as a stereo file. But for the purposes of this illustration, we can work with this file because I want to show you how we go about scoring. Go up to the window menu and select Express Track. With Express Track selected, I want to do a search on two different keywords. The first keyword is the word light. I want to find some music which is light and gentle. Then I want to search on a second keyword, and I want to find music which is lively. Light and lively. And it's isolated from all the clips that I had to work with. It's isolated down to four. I like Sherbet Fusion, and specifically, I like a piece called Click It but I don't want it to be 30 seconds long. Let's make it 25 seconds long. And when we listen to it, that sounds like a piece of music we could use for our, our underscore. So click insert and it automatically gets added to our timeline on a second track. Hmm, it's a little bit longer than my voiceover. First thing I want to do is click the voiceover to drag it where I want it to start, then retime the music by grabbing the trailing end of the edge of the music and dragging it where I want it to go. Now when we rewind and play, Welcome to Digital Production Bus. Talk radio for digital. Let's have that voiceover hit just a little bit sooner, like right about there. Retime that just a little bit more by dragging it and twirl down the volume envelopes. Double click to add a keyframe and just uh, let's just drag this one down a bit to have it do a little bit of a fade when the voice starts and play it. Welcome to Digital Production Buzz. Talk radio for digital production, post production, and distribution worldwide. My name is Larry Jordan, and joining us all the way from his remote headquarters, Mr. Mike Horton. Very nice. Now when it's time to output, we go File, Export, Export the entire mix soundtrack, and what we've been able to create is a final mix of our audio which we've imported and the music that we've scored from within Sonic Fire Pro. My name is Larry Jordan, and thanks for watching this Sonic Fire Pro tip.